Hello, welcome to Part of Rosa's World. Today I'm going to be sharing um, a few items that I picked up along with some items that I already have. And maybe if there's time, we might continue playing Disney Edition Color Brain because it has been a while. In the meantime, real quick, let me go pull up the chat as you guys know on my phone. Oh, and I got to turn the brightness down on my phone. I forgot to do that. Hi, John. How are you? I'm doing good. Thank you. Just pulling up the chat on my phone, and I forgot that my brightness is a little bit up on my phone today. Don't want that. Hi, Kim. How are you? Oh, I'm glad to hear, John. Okay, so that's set. Oh, and you know what? One more thing. And actually, no, I am curious... Hold on, let me see. I don't think I see the lighting that good. My other lamp I had for lighting broke. So I'm using a different one right now. Let me know if the lighting is a little bit too dark and I'll have to um, rearrange the lamp that I have. Hi Priscilla, hi Mar, how are you both doing? Well, I'm also, yeah, I totally forgot about that because I was kind of moving and rearranging around the little lamp I have until I get a new one because the one I used before broke. Which I was like, oh no, because that one is, well this one is bright, it's just more about moving it around. And while I get in there to see what you guys are saying, the lighting, I'm almost done. Well actually no, I'll kind of see that myself on my phone then too. Oh hi Ronnie, how are you? Hi London. And let me get, okay. I also want to make sure. Oh, nice, John. John's excited for his family vacation coming up February 24th and can't wait for the new Star Wars Galaxy's Edge. And then let's see. Okay, it's not too dark, but different. Yeah, that's. Uh, thank you, Mar. Okay. I think I'm all set over here. Say, oh no, Mar. So Mar says she's tired from moving bricks. Oh, but you're getting a new driveway. Well, nice that you're getting a new driveway. And as always, you guys, I have to real quick go attend to something. As you guys know, mom duties, but I will be right back. Sorry, you guys, be back.
Okay, sorry, right, right at the beginning, right? And mom duties, I even, I don't know if you guys heard me say, ouch, I bumped my hand over there real quick. But let me go back to see what I missed. And I will say, wow, there is a delay on my phone from my iPad because I, I was already seated down according to my iPad, but on my phone, I just sat down. That's so funny. But let me see real quick. Okay, I read that. And that. Oh, I know I also left off last. We were talking about Mar. That she started from moving bricks because we're getting the new driveway. And John's excited to see Mickey Mouse, Minnie Mouse, Goofy, Donald, Duck, and Pluto. That's so awesome, John. And I'll thank you, John. So sweet. John said, take your time, Rosette. <laughs> I know, right? Yes, moms always have chores that need attention. But that's so awesome, John. I hope you have a magical time with your family. Ooh, and yes, Kim just noticed. You know, the, also one thing that on my iPad, I see half of the calendar that Kim's talking about. But on my phone, I do fully see it. Which talking about, yes, I put my frozen calendar that I got from my aunt's. And let's see. But let's see, Marsha, there was a guy helping her, but still tiring. Yeah, I bet, Mar. Hey, Brittany's new page. How are you? And all right, yes, Mar. New Elsa calendar. Oh, nice, John. Yeah, true, Mar, because Mar says that's what makes it hard to play trivia in a live stream because some players get an answer faster. And yes, I was actually going to share that next. And, um, excuse me. Or so let's talk about my new shirt. I actually have um, a kind of theme color going on to match with the shirt. But yes, Priscilla's talking about this is my newest shirt of Mama Imelda. And it says, I know you can't really probably read it, but it says Mama Knows Best. And because as you can see, here our shadow is purple. This is why my nails or like a gel color purple, purple potion ears, and not sure how well you can tell, but my eyeshadow is a type of purple as well. Oh yes, John, I um have seen that. I follow you there. Yes, I seen that, Mar. That is so awesome. You know, I'm so um happy and excited about that for them. Oops. I know, speaking of, um, Kim's reminding me that she's telling Brittany that, yeah, cooking again. Brittany's always cooking. And I'm curious as well to what is Brittany cooking today? Well, in the meantime, while we, um, Wait for that. Yeah, I know, right? Thank you, Kim. Kim says congratulations to the Yaya family as well. I'm just trying to see, like, where should I get started? Mm -hmm. Let's see, I'll put the game over here. Put this one over there. <clears throat> but before we start the game, you know, I think I'll hold off on that one. First, I'll share these three items. One of them is... Um, not a Disney theme item, but I thought I would still share it because all these three items I got at the dollar store and I think I'll start with that item first. Um, I found it was, it already had the wrapping off, but I checked that if it was good condition, it was. The Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Turtles in Time 3, the Blu-ray was at the dollar store. I got my youngest son into, we're not into well yet into and you know to watch the Ninja Turtle movies because I um, was a huge fan of the Ninja Turtles when I was younger. I mean I still like them, but growing up, I remember when I was a kid, I can probably no you know what, actually I don't want to kind of give up my age. I was almost gonna say my grade, but um, I loved the teenage Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. But I got this at the Dollar Tree store. Isn't that crazy that I found this? And let's see, hold on. Is Brittany, is she making? Ooh, nice. That sounds good. A chicken salad sounds so good right now. 
Oh, I'm working out, Brittany. That's so good. I mean, I'm hoping to do that, to eat, you know, healthier and try to get in just some more exercise just overall, you know, to try to be healthy. But it's going to take some time and getting used to. <laughs> but how cool is this? Then, let me see, I'm trying to see where to put that. I'm going to put that right there. I actually still have the tag on this. Oh, thank you, Kim. Kim says to thumbs up the stream because we are live with Rosa. <laughs> but thank you, Kim, for the reminder. I actually, and I usually don't do that because um, I don't know if it makes a difference or matters or not myself doing it. But when I was pulling up the chat on my phone, I actually, um, I went and hit the thumbs up. That's because I usually don't. Well, at least for myself, I don't. For when I'm in other live streams, I do. <clears throat> and then this cute reusable shopping bag it has jasmine cinderella ariel and flounder i know right Brittany? i know what you mean because Brittany says believe me she says hey believe me it's not easy easy eating healthier especially if you're hispanic we have a lot of great food but it's not always healthy for you, but I love it. I know. So much good food, but not the healthiest for us, right? I know, right? Isn't it so cute? <coughs> oh, no, excuse me again. I will say, um, I mean, it's still good, but it's so much better with the stuff that's not healthy for you. My aunt cooks some of her um, foods um, healthier way. Like, oh, what's I can't remember the name of the salt, but there's like a different salt she uses. And just, I don't know. I mean, I can tell the difference compared to back then when she used to, you know, not cook healthy and then now eating healthy though. But hi, Noah, how are you? Oh, there's nothing inside my bag, Priscilla. Just empty. But I seen it and you know couldn't pass it up having the three princesses on there. <clears throat> then the last item, I guess I could open it and show you guys. Um, but this is Disney the Lion King. It has um eight different velvet posters that you color yourself. Can you guys, unless, I mean, you guys are okay, hold on. I'm going to turn my light a little bit. Because, I don't know, it's driving me a little bit crazy. Because, <laughs> like I said, the current, oh, no, maybe that might not work either. The lamp I had before, I feel like that's too on my forehead. It broke. No, yeah, I still see, Okay. You know what, you guys, so I'm going to disappear for a second again, and I'm actually going to turn my phone because the lighting is driving me crazy. So you just, I don't know if that will be too in my face. Let's see. Because see, now I see my shadow. Okay, maybe I'm not going to like that either. Maybe that's a little better. No, I still see like I have a shadow, huh? We have a Mickey Mouse bag. Mm. Maybe I should have left it how I had it, huh? At least for now. <laughs> but let's see. She's just trying to get into that beach body. Time to closer to stay away from that too long, just in moderation. Okay, but that's still good, Brittany. And then let's see, I think. Oh, yeah, thank you, John. And actually, because, you know, um, in case of those of you who wonder, I still decided to have my Christmas decorations up until the end of this month, then followed going to come into or coming to February 1st. Valentine decorations come up. I only have a little bit of Valentine's Day decorations, though. 
But back to you before I got distracted by my light over there. <clears throat> so these um, eight velvet color your own posters. And instead of showing you the back, the ones that are in there, I'm just going to take them out. I won't color them today, but I will show you guys. Hey, Carlos, how are you? And oh, yay, that's awesome. And speaking of, hold on, you just also reminded me that before I go on to what I was going to mention to Carlos, first I wanted to say that, Kim, sorry, I noticed I missed quite a few of your comments last week, but I noticed them in replay, and one of them, I will say, well, I mean, they all caught my attention, but especially more one that stood out. I remember partly reading it, but as you guys know, you know, my, you know, my Dory memories, I say, Kim was saying how, um, I'll, kind of, I'll just briefly show him, though. But of how she got stuck in the part, I forget for how long on the Haunted Mansion overlay on the part where Zero is. Because, you know, how much I love Zero and I just think he's so cute. But, uh, yeah, I don't know if I would feel the same way after being stuck there where Zero's at. And how long was it? Ten minutes? Oh, wow. <coughs> oh, excuse me. And the second thing, because it also, like I said, reminded me where I kind of do, like, I guess I'll say, like, or mentions or shout-outs, um, like, for comments, you know, that I happened to miss the previous time. But I know I can't imagine that. Kim says, bark, 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 bark. <laughs> um, but Carlos, I also want to say, um, you're so sweet. I noticed, because I watched their replay, there was a few times, I think twice, where I missed Midlife Vibes um, Tuesday night stream because I was busy, you know, attending to mom duties and stuff. And I noticed that both those times, you know, you happen to mention in there, where's Rosa? Rosa's missing. And I just thought, oh, that's so, you know, awesome and sweet of you to mention that. <laughs> oh, and you were alone, Kim? No, oh, no. Now that I can't imagine, you know, like being there with someone to kind of chat in between to distract from the fact that you're stuck in a certain spot and by yourself. Oh, no. Well, welcome back, John. And yes, I know that's. Um, you, John, that you have the two different, um, what's it called? Or names? I'm not sure if that's the right word I'm looking for. But, oh, one of them is small. And actually, oh, I see, but these are tiny. You guys will see in a minute what I'm talking about. I thought at least they would have been the size of the box. But some of them are stuck right here on this sheet. <laughs> like my life's manager, they're so funny. <laughs> um, but no, of course, Kim, like I said, that's mainly why I might hold on, rip this off. I go back because I know I miss comments or I may miss someone that comes in the chat. Like if they, um, I don't know, happen to, you know, comment once, or also, as you guys know, you know, Rosa has to sometimes step away because as we are live. Mom duties, you know, never stop, right? I know, it's so funny, their manager. <laughs> You're so funny, Carlos. Oh, my Carlos, that you just joined, I was, uh, or I am, I was going to say I was. I'm sharing this, um, la, la, can't even talk. I'm sharing this Disney Lion King Color Your Own Velvet posters that I got at the dollar store. But I thought that they were maybe the size of this box and they're actually smaller. But that's okay because they're still cute. But I'm um, taking them apart because they were stuck on one sheet. I know, right? Carly got family first. Oh, it looks really cool so far. I'm finishing packing. Oh, you're finishing packing your last Christmas decorations, Mar? I know, right? Isn't it? I, can, I totally relate to that, Mar. Maybe, let's see, no, next, next week we already are on February 1st, though, huh? Depending, um, how we go time-wise, now, maybe, because I'm already looking at the time and we haven't just shared a few other things, um, or maybe I'll see if I post a picture or not, maybe after I pack the stuff away, but I know what you mean, Mar, it is like a puzzle when you're packing your Christmas decorations in the container, because I know... The way how I put some of them away, that's not how I put them away last year. So 
So this first one, well, you know what, in a way then, I'm kind of glad then I guess that they're this small, the pictures, because it will be a lot of time to color in the pictures, right, if they were bigger. So here's the first one. Okay, well, thank you for stopping by. And, oh, nice to finish your resume. Yes, go finish um, your resume. That is important. And that's so awesome that you're working on that, Carlos. Tell um, the family I said hello. And hope you have a good rest of your night and week. And then here's the second one. I know it's so called a Lion King. I said, have a good night, Carlos. And then here is the third one. And you know, speaking of, it looks like already the ears already have not like been colored, but the material that they use there. Oh, thank you. And I definitely will let them know, Carlos. And then this one. And then the rest start in the package with the markers. And those ones weren't even in a sheet altogether. And then there's this one. And then, so here's the last of it with the markers. And there's that Simba cool. And then these are the last three. Well, that's so awesome though, Mar, <clears throat> that you have a list so you know what to put back in there. That's actually a great idea though, because, um, <coughs> oh, excuse me, like I was saying that, you know, um, I either end up getting a few more items and then I try to put them back in that same tub or I know that I, um, I know I'm, I know every time I'm not arranging them the same way they were the previous year and that's probably why I have trouble um packing them back up or maybe maybe make a list or take a picture of how I pack the stuff would probably help me because then I'm like I'm like wait a minute I had this stuff on this tub when I took it out why isn't it fitting <laughs> and then this is the last one that was in there and then it has these four different markers to color the images. But of course, if I'm not liking these colors or I want different colors, I will probably get my own markers that I have because we actually have quite a few of those. I have markers, I have crayons, I have colored pencils, paints. <laughs> actually, I have different colored Sharpies too. But those I actually have because when I had gone to Disneyland to get the characters to sign it or when I last had gone I had bought a frame where I had um Midlife Vibes sign it, the Yaya Chronicles, um Get Out TV, Juan signed it, Daisy signed it, I hope, I think, you know what, now that I think about it, I'm not sure, I don't think I had a human person sign it. Now that I think about it. Or even um, Kim and Sharon and her family. I think it was just, yeah, everyone that was hanging out with the rest of the evening. And now that I think about it, I should have done that. Or I should have got even a separate one. But so much stuff to try to remember, you know, too. Oh, yeah, definitely. Yeah, to, to go through the other side. This one's on the, you know what, actually, I have it in my car. Because I actually... Um, I'm going to make a copy of what we signed because I need, uh, or I have something planned with it. But I'm trying to think. So I was trying to think in my mind if I know where the one signed is to show you. But 
Yeah, no, let me go sip away. Let me go check real quick. It's gonna drive me crazy. I'm curious if that's where it's at. It's just like right here. Oh, but it's way up there in the frame. Yeah, I don't, maybe next time I'll, I'll share that with you guys what I'm talking about. Because it is way up on my wall and I would have to get a chair to climb up there and stuff. So maybe next time. I know, right? Yeah, that you're expecting. Yeah, I honestly really did. And you know what? I don't even know. Yeah, you know what? It doesn't even say the size, but I just assumed that they would be almost the size of the box. So then, let me see. I was going to see. I don't even know how we would do this, though. Oh, I see. We'll see if there's time though, but I just thought I would still share it only because as I'll share it one more time, you know, I was excited for my newest shirt that I have today of Mama Imelda. <laughs> okay, John. Well, thank you for stopping by. Have a good night. Have a great rest of your week and have a great Tuesday as well. And I'll thank you. Good night to your family as well, John. Ooh, my favorite Disney character. And, oh, no, I'm curious. Okay, no, I don't think we are buffering. Because in my end, or at least my phone, it always does this to me. And, wow, so weird. I'm also just curious. On my phone, I don't see it. But over there, it shows up. Um, John saying you're welcome. Rosa, thank you. Like, several times. That's so weird. <laughs> But I don't see it in this end. Um, but I was referring to since because I have that shirt on. But I think I really want to show the next item and then maybe have time to play a game with you guys. Um, but I would I would still bring it out at least and show you guys. I had showed it a while back. Um, but it's Disney Pixar Coco. You create a magical mosaic scene. So I hope I said that right. And actually, you know what? I should take off the clearance. No, uh, maybe I'll leave. I just, no, I'll take the clearance sticker off later. It was originally $7.99, but then they had dropped the price down to $3.98. Look at how cool. Now, I was, before, I was trying to figure out what exactly you do with it. But see, here's the mosaic stickers. And then back here, you have... The images where the stickers will get placed. That is so cool. But because I have to peel the stickers and stuff, I at least wanted to share that with you guys so I can show you guys the next thing. I did share the cork board that I got for $1.50 at the Daiso store, but now, and I know I have a few more pins floating around that I got to find, um, and the dresser that's right, or not the dresser, the desk that's right in front of me over there. Or one more area where I think they're at. But I got all my pins put on here. But you know, I am curious, are we still live? Because I don't see, or not still live, um, are we buffering? Please let me know because I don't see the chat moving on my phone. Or the chat moving over there. Okay, wait, there's, I see Kim's comment. Okay, so it looks like we are not. But, you know, I know I asked before too, but I'm curious, you know, that lighting, at least in my end, how I sit on my phone, it is driving me crazy. That I almost want to go move the light again. <laughs> Ooh, and I forget that those poke in the back. Let's see. No, yeah, that didn't. Let me see. Sorry, you guys, that I keep messing. I should have done, like, maybe a test with the light before I went live. Yeah, I don't think this light's going to work. I'm going to have to work on getting a new one soon. So I do apologize to you guys 
And for the replay viewers, about my lighting, the lamp that I had before broke over the weekend. And you know what? I wonder, let's see. Maybe I'll scoot them up closer for you guys to see. I will say this pin right here, though, this was my first pin that I had bought. Yes, that they're made of chips of glass, Mark. Yeah, and the stickers get filled like that. I'm curious to see what they look like once they get filled like that, though. So this pin right here was the first pin that I had bought myself. That was the year that I had gone on my adult-only trip with my oldest niece and my two aunts. And because I love Stitch, and then it had the year that I had gone, that is why I bought this one. And then this one is the um, Fairy Godmothers from Sleeping Beauty, and it said Squad Goals. I got it <coughs> oh, excuse me, sometime last year. I know I shared um, a while back. I forget what I have it titled under. Maybe Magic Mail or something from the Disney store. But I had bought this when they had free um, shipping. But I thought it was so funny and cool, the squad goals, because um, I would tell my oldest joking around, like I wish I had, you know, their powers, like how she sets it up to, boom, make, you know, bake the cake for her. And the other one for the mopping and sweeping. And another one helping her, you know, make the dress. And then this one, my aunt had bought it. I believe she said when it was a first, well, it wasn't her first time, but she had one tickets and she gave, it was a family four pack and the other three she gave to um, us for us to go and it was our first time that we had gone and she had this saved and totally forgot about it and when she was cleaning out her closet, she gave this to me, the stitch trying to put a letter in. And then let's see, I'm actually not um, trying to put her in the spotlight or anything, but I did ask her and she said it was fine um, and not all at once, but <laughs> this one, this one, this one, oh no, wait, not, not, hold on, not that one. So I'm trying to point not facing. So let me start again. So this one, this one, this one, and that one, and that one, and that one, this one, this one, that one, this one, this one, and I actually have to look because I want to point the wrong ones. This one, and I think, if not, he'll let me know, and I think this one, this one I forget. But I'm trying to see because I recognize, I have to look at my phone closer. Duh. Oh, we don't know what my phone did, you guys. Because I thought, okay, no, I was first. But hi, oh, the book reviews collector, how are you? Um, are from Kim. And then this one right here is from Tony and Vanessa from Disney RL TV. I'm glad to hear. And then, wait, what am I seeing? And oh, can I think? Sorry, I was, in, I was like, what is right here? The wait, but it's a snowflake. And then this one, this one, and I believe this one, and this one. Um. My ex-boyfriend got those. Well, at the time, he was my boyfriend, but not um, any longer. But he had got me those. And then this Rebel one here, um, I know it's not a Disney one, but because it's a pin, I put it on my pin board. It's from a coffee place that we have called Dutch Bros Coffee. Oh, and then I almost forgot this little one right here, and it's actually a different style. My dad got me this one at um, a flea market. 
And actually, the reason why I say the style is different because look, when I pull it out, he's like on a, almost like a needle type looking style. And what I did, I put in a sandwich bag, you know, the pin, the backs to the pins. So in case if I ever, you know, take them off here, that I have those. So these are all my pins. And I was so excited that I finally was able to get a cork board, you know, for $1.50 at the Daiso store. Ooh, and every time I touch the back, though, I forget that these backings, you know, they kind of poke from the pins. Oh, thank you. Oh, and then last item before, let's see if we have time to play Disney Edition Color Brain. I want to share real quick this cute calendar I got at the dollar store. It goes on this little stand, but it's a little dog. Oh, wow, nice, Mar. I did not know that Mar says that type of pin can be used on a scarf to hold it in place or as decorations. So this is how it came in the packaging, but then you remove this one. And then here's the only thing it doesn't say January. It says it has the months by numbers, but this is number one. Yeah, you love color brain. Hey, human person, how are you? Oh, no worries at all. So that's you're getting a oh that's awesome though that you're getting a head start on some of your performing pieces for the upcoming semester next week. That's always good when you can get you know a head start on um stuff that um you know you need to do for school. And then it goes through all the months, but then I thought, how am I gonna keep track like of the date? So what I did with the other one, because this one's my youngest son's, I got a purple sharpie and I'm just gonna circle um, you know, the dates that we already passed and the one that's not circled. That means that's the date that we're on. But how cute is this? So then, because it's been a while, we'll probably then spend the last 20 minutes playing this game. The only thing, my cards are kind of like, I don't know, they kind of went out of the spot. We probably might, I hope not though, be playing some of the ones we already have played, but I hope not because I had them. At least I thought I did. You know what, just to be sure, I think I'll probably, hold on, I'm gonna, let me move this off the table so I'm not moving. Or maybe it's these ones. It's because there were some that I placed the opposite way to know which ones we played. And now I'm like, I don't even know. But maybe because it's been a while, maybe it wouldn't even matter. You bought a calendar like that, I can do for yourself. I know, right? Yeah, it happens to me all the time, Mar, where I buy something and then I forget. Well, like, I think... I had bought a calendar, wall calendar for this year and I couldn't find it. Okay, I see I'm kind of recalling these ones. So I'm just trying to put the box down. But on some, I'm not sure. I'm like, which ones did we have left to play? Because it's been a while. think I'm going to... Just grab some from the middle. Because it's been a while since we played this game. I forget where we were at and I would have to probably go back on that live stream the last time we played it to see which cards we have played.
Now I am playing it a little bit different, of course, than how I usually would sit down, you know, with players, other players and play. But if anyone would like to know how to actually play it, let me know. Hi, Six Hand Spies, how are you? Because I have the rules right here. We were playing Disney Edition Color Brain. I just wrapped up sharing a few Dollar Tree items and my pin collection on this cork board that I had got. So I will show you guys, well not show you yet because I'll not be showing you the answer. I'll read you the movie and what it's asking for and then <clears throat> you have to guess which colors it is or how many colors because there is more than one. Oh, you never heard of this game, Mar? Let me... <coughs> oh, excuse me. So the way you play it, it says the aim of the game is the first team to reach 10 points wins. Win points by answering color brains crafty questions using the 11 color cards in your hand. And then the preparation for the game this game is for two to four players or teams. You can have as many players on each team as you like. Each team chooses a numbered mascot. And then each team takes the 11 color cards featuring their numbered mascot. You should have blue, green, red, orange, yellow, brown, pink, black, white, purple, and gray in your hand. That's a lot of colors, by the way. Players or teams each get one color capture card. And then it has a score pad as well. Oh yeah, that's the only thing. Or I'm just gonna read the um, directions for how you actually play it. But I, um, since I want to have fun playing it with you guys, I do change it a little bit how I play it. Oh wait, let's see. Is Noah leaving? Did I miss that real quick? Let's see. There's that. Oh, no, wait, I think, okay. Well, bye, Kim. Thank you for stopping by and being here. Nope, the 4-H goes well, and you're welcome. Thank you, too. Yeah, that's what then I caught myself. I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> but thank you, Mark. So the way, you know, you actually play it, if I had other players with me, then I read out a question card to the room, making sure that no one, including me, can see the answer on the back. And then we use the 11 colors in hand and we decide which color and so on. And then it has like a scoring time time and stuff. But the way how I do it, <coughs> oh, excuse me, since, you know, I can't physically hand the cards to you guys. Oh, yeah. Thank you, Mar. Yeah, I just caught up and seen that. But thank you so much, Mar. I think she probably, I missed that when I was probably looking down and reading the instructions. But thank you. Um. So the way I, the way I do it. I'll actually, let me see. I'll show an example real quick. But you know what? Because I want to show you. I want to play that one with you guys. I'm going to pick a different one. Ooh, and that one. You know what? I'll go with one over here. So, for example, I won't show you yet the back. But this is from Disney Pixar Inside Out. And there's only one color that you have to guess which color it has. So, what is the main color of Disgust? And then I will, you know, read that like I did right now to you guys. And then... I'll, I will show you guys the different colors, you know, to choose from. And say someone says, I'm actually going to show you the color that it actually is. Someone says green. And boom, they were correct. It is green. And again, we also are just, you know, playing this just for fun. Since I can't convince my boys to play this game with me. So now we actually are going to play it. Um, and you guys take a guess from the different 11 colors that I have, which color is it? Oh, sorry, Mar, if I said that too fast. That one was just an example, but it was from the main color of Disgust from Disney Pixar Inside Out. But that one was just an example that I was showing for those that, um, including you that haven't, you know, played it. And then plus, it has been a while since I have played this with chat. But now, we are going to play now for fun. That was just um, an example. And for practice, I guess, is what I'll call it, too. <clears throat> so now, and hold on. Sorry if I said that too fast. I sometimes have a habit of doing that. Oh, you haven't seen that, Mar. You should check that out. I, I, it's been a while since I've seen it, but I really liked it. So it's about saying all the different, you know, emotions. 
Okay, so now here we go. <clears throat> so there's only one color involved to guess, and then I will show you guys the colors after, but unless you know if you already know, you know, feel free to put that. So this is from Disney Tim Burton's The Nightmare Before Christmas. It's on your watch list from Disney Plus. Nice. And it's asking, oh, and you know what? I actually showed this character earlier too. But so Zero, the ghost dog's nose. So what color is Zero's nose? And it's only one color. <clears throat> and the colors you have to choose from, black, green, yellow, and already in the minute I'll say who already got it right in my end. Pink, blue, red, orange, white, brown, gray, and purple, my favorite color. And the first one I see in my end because they are also so fast to um, answer. Six hand spice guess red, but it is not red. And the first one I see in my end is Noah with orange, followed by Mar. But there it is. But I will say some already know right away because, you know, if you already have seen those movies, you're like, wait, I know this. I will say when I play games, I sometimes get excited and I'll put in, you know, the wrong answer, but I knew it, but it's because I got so excited, like, oh, I knew this. And then I'm like, oh no, I typed the wrong answer in. You know, and just, just for fun though, you know, I should have wrote down, or better yet, as the first one I see guessing first, maybe I'll just do that. But just for fun, I'm going to note down Noah has guessed one right. And, um, and again, just for fun, I'm going to go with whoever, you know, I see it comment at first at my end. Because I know that sometimes you guys um, may see it differently or in your end is what I've noticed in other streams. <coughs> oh, excuse me again. So this is from Disney Wreck-It Ralph. And there's one color involved. Wreck-It Ralph's undershirt. And there's one color involved from Wreck-It Ralph. His Ralph's undershirt. We got gray, purple, brown, white, orange, red, blue, pink, yellow, green, or black. And I already see a few answers. Let's see. Mar says red. No, it is not red. And it's referring to his undershirt. And then let's see. Noah says brown. It is not brown. To me and my end. Oh, wow. Did I show it? I'm a, to me and my end, that doesn't even look that color in the picture. But it's asking about his undershirt. So it looks like first I see, you know, he has his overalls. Then he has one shirt on, but he has another shirt underneath that shirt. And it's referring to his the shirt underneath. So it is not red. It is not brown. I think what I'll do, I'll put the colors in front of me that are not it to then show you what's left. I believe the other guess or the other guess was brown. So I still don't see the correct guess. So we either have left black, green, yellow, pink, blue orange, white, purple, or gray to choose from. I will say with this game, you know, it is about having a good memory and stuff. Sure, Mar, <laughs> you can phone or text a friend. <laughs> you know, I, if I would be the one playing, I would have, um, you know what I should do the next one around, but I just won't count it if I guess it right. I should probably guess along with you guys on the next one. But of course, like I said, you know, I won't count my window. I'll leave it for you guys. And while I wait real quick to see one more color, I will be right back again. Because of those mom duties. Okay, I will. Hold on. 
And Noah guessed it right. It is green. I guess if you don't mind, and we'll keep going the few minutes extra that I have to walk away, I have to attend to one more mom duty that is going to keep me away for a couple of minutes. So if you guys, oops, sorry about that, because I'm going to bring my phone with me though. But if you guys please let someone know if they join, I will be right back. Okay, sorry, I am back. And thank you guys for still sticking around. But good one, Noah asked a question. In the meantime, um, and said, a good one, what color is Mickey's shorts? And I'm not sure if I've seen anyone answer that. And real quick, because I forgot if I showed it. I don't remember. But there it is. And I think human person says that he thought it was brown. Is a new piece of info to you? Well, I will say to me, it doesn't even look green. To me, it looks the color of turquoise. And I'll thank you, Mar. Yeah, I had to step away for a minute, Priscilla, to attend to mom duties. <laughs> Hi, Lori. How are you? I'm doing good, thank you. <coughs> oh, excuse me. We are playing Disney Edition Color Brain. So from Disney, Sleeping Beauty, and one color only. The main color of Maleficent's horns. What is the main color of Maleficent's horns? We have brown, 
red, black, green, yellow, pink, blue, orange, white, purple, or gray. And I see Noah. I, oh, no, wait. Human person. I take that back. Followed by Noah. And again, we are playing this just for fun. But then I see followed by Priscilla. Oh, nice. You're going to see Disney on Ice next. Oh, that's right. It comes in February. That is so awesome. <coughs> oh, excuse me. And then followed by Lori guessing it. So from this one is two colors from Finding Nemo. Mr. Ray. What color is Mr. Ray? And there's two colors. And I forgot that I said I was going to play along just for fun. Maybe the next one. Oh, wow. Yeah, maybe I should do that next one too. You'll see why in a minute. Um, But there's two colors, Noah. And I see human person with the two colors together. So Noah and human person are tied to two. Oh, and actually, I forgot to say too. Um, to list them together, though, if it's more than one color. So I apologize for not saying that ahead of time. Fishes are friends and not food, right? <laughs> there it is. So this one, but I might not be as fast as you guys. And I don't even know if I'm going to get it right. This is from Frozen. And there's four colors. So I don't forget to put all the four colors together. Olaf the snowman. And let's see. I should know this, but... Oh, and I'm missing one more color. Mm, maybe. Okay, I have my choices over here. I did not look. I want to see if I got it right. So we have red, green, yellow, pink, blue, purple, gray, black, brown, orange, and white. Now before I turn that over, I'm going to let you guys know what I picked to see if I got it right. I said black, brown, orange, and white. Let's turn it over and see who got it right. Let's see, white, brown. Ooh, I did guess it right, but I just decided to play it for fun to test myself to see if I knew this. But let's go back and see who had it first. Human person, let's see, human person is white, brown, black. Nice, human person. Oh my goodness, you guys, anyone, I gotta sneeze and then I don't, ooh. But got it correct first. Followed by, let's see, yep, yeah, Mar. And then Mar put it exact. Nice one. Oops, sorry, you guys. Well, at least on my end. And also, real quick, Pepper Tree, Pepper Tree Villa is live right now. Disney 2020 Vision is the title of their stream. If you guys haven't checked them out, please go and do so. Pepper Tree Villa, they are live right now. Also, if you haven't already, Steve's World goes live an hour before me. If you have not checked them out, also, please go and do so. But Mar said it to the exact point. She said white snow orange nose brown arms and black eyes <coughs> oh, excuse me you guys oh i don't know i don't know if i want to but maybe i could i guess for fun a human person says he just remembered from the ending of frozen 2. this one is from disney the princess and the frog Dr. Felicier's hat, and there is three colors. What did I do with the rest of my color cards? Oh, they're over here. I'm like, where do they go? So Disney Princess and the Frog, three colors involved. Dr. Felicier's hat. We have red, green, yellow, pink, blue, purple, gray, orange, brown, black, and white. And let's see, I see human person already asking. Um, I see, wait, I wanna make sure. Okay, you have two colors correct, human person. 
Um, the black and white is correct, but you're missing one more color. And let's see, Mar says black, purple, yellow. You are correct with one color, Mar, and that's black. Mom? Yeah. Okay, hold on. While I wait for the answers, I will be right back, you guys. And let me go see real quick what I um if anyone guessed it correctly. Let's see, Lori said and no black is the only color you have correct, Lori. And thank you, Priscilla. And let's see, I believe Mar got it correct. Black, red, and white. Mar, yay, you're going on the scoreboard for one. <laughs> I would have guessed purple too, though, and I would have guessed wrong. Yeah, so it looks like the hat, of course, you know, is all black, and then because of the scaling tin head, it's white, and then the red ribbon. And again, also the reminder, you know, I go with whose answer I see first in my end. So this is from Disney Hercules, one color. Hades hair when he meets the infant Hercules. So from Hercules, Hades hair when he meets the infant Hercules and it's one color. And our options are red, green, yellow, pink, blue, purple, gray, orange, brown, black, and white. And here in person, it is not red. So, um, up, oh, and Mar got it. Blue. Way to go, Mar. <laughs> Followed by Priscilla. This one's from Disney Tank Disney's Tangled. Hi, the Amtrak Traveler. How are you? We are playing Disney Edition. Color Brain and I will read a card that will name a Disney slash Pixar movie. And then, like, the next one, for example, it's actually no, I won't say that one yet because then you guys will start guessing. Um, like the one we just did, this is just an example for Amtrak Traveler who just joined. So I just read Disney Hercules, Hades hair when he meets the infant Hercules and it is one color only and Mar was the first to guess that it was blue. And we have 11 different color choices to choose from. <coughs> Excuse me. And um, we are just playing this, you know, just for fun. So far I will say we have human person in the lead with three. 
followed by Noah and Mar, tied by two. Ooh, nice, because Mar made, she made a Hades costume for her son-in-law, and he had to buy a blue wig. That is so awesome, though, Mar. So next one, from Disney Tangled, Rapunzel's dress and one color. So from Tangled, Rapunzel's dress and one color. And we have the options to choose from are green, yellow, pink, blue, purple, gray, orange, brown, black, and white. And it is not pink. This one, though, to be honest, is not fair because there is more than one color, but it's asking, I guess, the overall, the main one. But human person says, I always found it interesting that when Hades gets mad, he goes from blue to red. Since scientifically cold colors like blue is harder than warm colors like orange. And first one I see, and human person even being more specific though, but purple. And he said lavender purple. But it is purple. Because see, it doesn't give specifics. It just says Rapunzel's dress. Even though we know that she has like a little bit of different colors on her dress. Because I know, I'm pretty sure there's like pink ribbon somewhere there on her dress. <clears throat> so now we have from Toy Story, Mr. Potato Head's ears and one color. So Mr. Potato Head's ears. A conspiracy. <laughs> And let's see, it is not orange. And the first one I see is Noah with pink. <clears throat> and so it's looking at the time. And plus, because I um had several times I had to step away from mom duties, I think we will go until 7.30 today. <clears throat> so next one. From Disney Zootopia and one color only Nick's paw popsicles and then in parentheses it says not the stick whatever that is referring to I haven't I've only seen this movie once so from Disney Zootopia Nick's paw popsicles and in parentheses it says not the stick and first one I already see up wait Actually, Amtrak Traveler, I think that was your last guess right from the last game. Right? I just want to make sure so I give the um, correct answer to the right person. Because I see the Amtrak Traveler say blue, white, LOL, red. I think that was your last guess from the previous, right? I just want to make sure, though, because um, I was about to say that human person got it first. But I want to make sure, I don't know, I think the Amtrak Traveler was referring to the other one. Or was it for now, from this one? Okay, so then Amtrak Traveler, I just wanted to make sure then because I'm followed by a human person. I probably, what I should do though for next time so I don't mix myself up too. Um, maybe I'll wait a few seconds before I say we're going to move on to the next one. It's maybe or if anyone is up to you guys want to put what is that like slashes or something to know that we're starting the next card if anyone wants to do that it's up to you guys let me know though if someone wants to do that and then I'll give you a few seconds forever wants to do that for me so I can make sure you know you get enough time to um, take a guess too but let me know oh there we go okay thank you human person and then in between I'll wait a few seconds so or there from band traveler so I, you know, make, give you guys a start or for you guys to be able to start to with the following answer. So there we go. So this is from Disney Pinocchio and it's one color only. Pinocchio's eye color. Okay. Yeah. So thank you. Yes, I'm Trailer. Thank you for your help. I think I'll have then human person, um, do that for me. That way, like he said, so I don't confuse myself as well, too. But thank you. And now, hold on. I see the answers coming in. And the first right guess I see is Noah with blue.
And all, thank you, Mar. As Mar said, roses for Rosa. <laughs> It said Pinocchio's eye color that it's blue. Oh, he must have <laughs> a different version. Yeah, I don't know. It says they're blue. I, like I said, will forget because, um,. You know, it's a lot of paying attention to detail to remembering the color of these characters. And you know what I think I'll do real quick? I'm going to lay out the different colors in front of me. That way I just read them off as I see them. I think that's what I'll do. So next up. From Disney Pixar Monsters University and there's two colors Roar Omega Roar jerseys and I'll thank you human person that's why I kind of took a little bit of my time <laughs> to read it so from Disney Pixar Monsters University two colors Roar Omega Roars jerseys what color are they and they are not white and blue. You know, maybe I'll stack the guesses so then I kind of keep track. So the colors left are pink, red, green, yellow, black, brown, orange, gray, or purple. And let's see, Priscilla says white and blue. They are not white and blue. Amtrak Traveler says white and red. I will say there is red involved. And remember to put the two colors together. And I believe I see Noah with it, red and yellow. Oop, I'm about to drop my cards. You have, oh, you have, I was going to say you haven't seen it, but okay, you haven't seen it in a while. Yeah, I wouldn't have remembered either. It's been a while since I've seen this. And you know what, you guys, when I just realized, oh, wait, okay, I think this will be the next stack. And real quick, so we have Noah in the lead with five, followed by Human Person with four, and Mar with two, and the Amtrak Traveler with one. <coughs> oh, excuse me, you guys. Now, I am curious if my phone... Because I just noticed it in the comments, too. That there's like a delay from my phone and iPad. <laughs> it's funny of having the delay. Because I am streaming from my iPad, but I have the chat on my phone. So I can try to keep up with the comments. So next up. We have from Disney Zootopia, and there's one color involved. Thank you, human person. The fur of Flash, the fastest sloth working at the DMV. So it wants to know, what is the color of the fur of Flash, the fastest sloth working at the DMV, and one color only? Human person guessed brown. It is not brown. And let me see. First up, I see Mar with gray. And all right, the fastest lot working at the DMV. <laughs> uh, that's funny. Flash dash. 100 yard dash. Oh, wait, why did I move this color? I'll put it over there. Sorry, guys, I'm just kind of moving the cards around. I don't know why I moved them over there. Okay, 
Okay, so next up, we have from Disney Aladdin, and it's one color, the Genie's Wrist Cuffs. And our choices of colors are blue, pink, white, brown, yellow, red, black, brown, orange, gray, or purple. And it's asking for the Genie's wrist cuffs. One color only. And let's say it's not red or blue. And the first one I see, it is yellow. From Noah again. <laughs> so wow, Noah, you're, you got six points. I know technically though, Mar, it is, yeah, gold. And you know what? Um, I know the last time I had played this, I had said too, why can't they add the, ye the, the yellow? Why can't they put the color gold in here for option though? Because technically, you are correct. It is gold, right? Not yellow. So I don't know why they couldn't instead put in the color gold for your options though. You will notice that they do that with some of the cards. Like, come on, you could have added gold or, I don't know, other more specific, you know, colors. Right? Or silver. Instead, they have gray. <clears throat> yeah, I don't know why they um, do that. Sorry, you guys. I keep like, I don't know, feeling my hair on my face. I can have it of moving it. <laughs> but so next up, we have, but let's see, hold on. Uh, Houston, we have a problem. We are under attack. <laughs> So this next one is from Disney Pixar Finding Nemo, and it is one color. Accent on the scuba diver's gear. So what is the accent on the scuba diver's gear? And it is one color from Finding Nemo, or from the Finding Nemo movie is what I meant to say. Up, oh, and I see the Amtrak Traveler with green. There it is. So next up, from Disney Aladdin, and it's three colors. So remember, don't forget to put all your three colors, your guests, all together. But it wants to know Abu's hat. Gosh, I wouldn't even remember all these colors. <laughs> but from Disney Aladdin, a booze hat. And there's three colors involved. What are they? Oh, and that's I got to keep track. Okay, let's see. So I'm going to red, yellow, and brown. Let's see. You do have the red and yellow correct, but no brown. And then Mar says they probably leave gold out to maintain consistency of the color choices. Oh, true. That's probably um, correct, Mar. Maybe why. And let's see. I'm touch I followed by red, yellow, and black. No. So there's a missy. You got the red and yellow correct. But what is that third color? So there's no. Let's see. I'm trying to miss. Or let's see. Noah. Yep. Noah got it. Correct. Purple, yellow, and red. But Noah does have it, but the order doesn't matter, but it is correct for um, Noah. And see, this is what I mean, though, but I get that, like, that top color to me on his hat, that looks like magenta to me. <laughs> no, uh, yeah, you have seven correct or seven points as I'm calling it. <laughs> so again, real quick, I'll recap. Noah has seven points, followed by Human Person with four, Mar with three, and Amtrak Traveler with two. And again, I do go with the answer who I see first, and that's you know how I have you guys on the scoreboard. And Amtrak Traveler says, "I'm coming for you, Noah." <laughs> yeah. You know what? I really did several of these movies. You, as you guys know, I'm going to say this word probably wrong. 
I can see if he, Genoa. So next up, <laughs> no, it says, uh-oh, LOL. From Disney Pixar, The Good Dinosaur, and there's one color involved, Arlo is all it gives me. So I'm assuming it's asking overall, what is the color of Arlo from The Good Dinosaur? Let's see who types that in first. The Amtrak Traveler. Oh, he's on it. It is green. <laughs> Watch out, Noah. <laughs> Followed by Noah and then Priscilla. Yeah, I'm curious. Has everyone seen this movie, The Good Dinosaur? I'm just curious and wondering. I've seen it a few times, and I actually, I love this movie. Oops. And it just slipped right out of my hand, just like that. <laughs> So next up, we have from Disney, Frozen. Yes, I love the, oh, you love the graphics? Yeah, the graphics are so awesome and cool on um, the movie, The Good Dinosaur. So from Disney, Frozen, one color. Anna's dress at her sister's coordination. That's not kind of fair. Those are different colors, but I guess um, it's overall asking for the main color. And it is not purple. So Anna's dress at her sister's coordination. It is not brown. <laughs> so we got blue, purple, white, green, yellow, red, black, brown, orange, gray, or purple. And let's see. Nope, it is not light blue. Oh, wait. Noah, oh, wait. Real quick. I almost missed it. Noah, green. But I will say to be fair, you know, it should say more specific. I was asking about the main color of her dress or not because it is not just green. And that's what I mean where sometimes it doesn't get specific, but it's still fun to play this. So next up, from Toy Story, two colors, Andy's cowboy hat. We have been robbed this round. <laughs> so Andy's cowboy hat. Two colors from Toy Story. What are they? Um, let's see. There is red, but no yellow. And no brown. And remember to put your color answers together, though. But two colors. Let's see, Marissa says, nope, there's no brown. There is red. So what is the second color? I guess even, we don't really kind of need then the color cards. I'll just have you guys just guess colors. It is not red and black, but there is red. But what is that other color? And I, nope, oh, wait, I almost got confused. Red and black, no, there is red, but no black. What is that second color? But there is red. Red and what other color? Not red and silver. Red and one more color. This is kind of tricky though. No red and green. There is red involved though. And I see Mar, red and white. Because talking about, I guess, like the kind of, the, I don't know what you call it, like the yarn or the string around the hat. <laughs> see if I hope I say his name right I should be able to say it right next up we have from Beauty and the Beast two colors what color is and I hope I say his name right Lumiere two colors from Beauty and the Beast oh thank you human person We do have a couple of few minutes left and let me see I see the Antron Traveler yes yellow and white I almost want to stay on just a bit long because I want to see if the Antron Traveler can catch up to Noah real quick another recap Noah is in the lead with eight followed by actually wait okay so Noah's in the lead with eight 
we now have Human Person, Mar, and the Amtrak Traveler all tied with four. But Noah is still in the lead with eight. <laughs> Maybe I should, um, I know I said 7.30, but at least go until either if Noah reaches 10 or if, um, Human Person or Mar or the Amtrak Traveler reach 10. Maybe. We'll see. So from Monsters University, two colors. What are the main colors of art? From Monsters University. And I'm curious. Um, I forget that this character's name is even art. Or what about Winner Takes All? <laughs> no blue and green. A little bit quick, one more time, they'll read the colors while I wait for your guesses. <clears throat> blue, pink, white, green, yellow, red, black, brown, orange, gray, and purple are our color options. <laughs> Mar, <laughs> you're so funny, Mar, because Mar says, I'm dreaming if I think I'm going to reach 10. I think it's possible, Mar. But real quick then, because it's I drag with Mars comment. Let's see, so it's not blue and green. And then, oh wait, I think uh, Amtrak Traveler first with purple and pink, followed by Human Person. So Amtrak Traveler, you have five now. Purple and pink. And then followed by Noah and Priscilla. <clears throat> Next up <clears throat> from Choice Story One Color Mr. Potato Head's Nose. What color is Mr. Potato Head's Nose? <clears throat> oh, excuse me again. No, thank you, human person. It is not brown. I think you meant pink, but it is not pink. That actually would have been my first guess. And I think Mar meant to say red because it says Ted. But I'm sure you meant red, Mar. <laughs> yeah, I thought so. <laughs> oh, and let's see. So not pink, not red, not black. You know, pink was going to be my guess, but it is not pink. Not brown. And the Amtrak Traveler with orange. Amtrak Traveler now has six. <laughs> Catching up there. <clears throat> Noah has eight. Amtrak Traveler now has six. And Human Person and Mar have four. <clears throat> So next one up is from Zootopia, one color, Nick's shirt. What color is Nick's shirt from Zootopia, one color, I know right, he's on a streak. Oh, and there it is, green, <laughs> followed by Noah. But, you know, I am curious real quick before I read the next card. See, in my end, it shows the Amtrak Traveler with the first guess, green, followed by Noah and then Priscilla. I'm curious to, in your guys' end, is that who you see first, too, the Amtrak Traveler? I'm just curious because um, it was from Indulib's dad streams when I first came across this channel um, gosh, I want to say over a year, it's been in last October, it was a year ago, he was doing trivia and I started noticing that the answer that he would see was different on my end. And that's why I'm just curious. And that's why, like I said, you know, I do mention and cause I am aware of it and have seen it happen that some answers appear differently in my end than for you guys. But okay. I was just curious. The Amtrak Traveler says it's the same for him. Okay. 
I was just wondering, you know, just curious on that. Because like I said, I have noticed that on other streams. So next up, from Disney Winnie the Pooh, one color, Rue's sweater. What color is Rue's sweater from Winnie the Pooh? And I see the Amtrak Traveler first with blue, followed by Noah. Okay, I've seen the same thing happen, Mart and um, Amy of a AJC Magic TV. But wow, so now we have Noah and the Amtrak Traveler tied with eight. Give you a harder one. <laughs> uh, let's see. I don't know if this one's hard for you. It would be for me, but I'm going to give it a try. It may or may not be hard for you, Noah, but let's see. And oh, real quick though, you guys, before I be the next one, hold on, you guys. And I'll actually, I'll be right back. I'll tell you guys why in a minute, why I know I'm being called. <laughs> So I think you guys, plus, because I did go past, I said past um, until 7.30. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Unless, real quick, well, unless you guys, okay. I have one more mom duty I got to attend to that would probably take me about five minutes. Do you guys say either, because I am curious between Noah and the Amtrak Traveler 2, though. Do um, you guys mind waiting again? Because as you guys know, I had stepped away earlier quite a few times. Um, but for the next mom lady that I got to do for like at least five minutes or less, it's going to take me to step away. So you guys want to mind holding off while I go real quick and then come back so we can still finish up a few more rounds. Okay, if you guys don't mind then, why don't maybe you guys either ask each other some fun questions or something for fun for trivia. I'll be right back then.
Robin. Okay, sorry, I'm back. What did I miss? Did I miss anything? I know, right, though? Sure, everyone is a winner, though. Ooh, what is that, though? Watch Superstore. I'm curious to what that is. And where did, okay, I was like, where did my card go? But you know what, before we answer, you answer that Amtrak Traveler, though, let's real quick get one more. Let, I'm not sure if I picked a hard one or not for Noah. That way you have a chance to guess at this real quick, though. So from Toy Story 2, one color. Emperor Zerg's mouth. What color is it? One color. Emperor Zerg's mouth from Toy Story 2. Oh, let's see what that cut. It is not gray, not red. <laughs> let's see, so no gray or red. From Toy Story 2. Emperor Zerg's mouth in one color. Not black. So we got left brown, orange, purple, blue, pink, white, green, or yellow. And I see the Amtrak Traveler with yellow first. And that right there breaks the tie though. So we have the Amtrak Traveler with nine, Noah with eight, and human person and Mar with four. Good job, everyone. But you too, Priscilla, you know, good job guessing. I will say I definitely would have guessed all of these wrong. And then back to then, let's see, so it's Superstore, it's a Sean NPC. Oh, you know what? I think I might have seen um not like an ad but like how was it called commercial maybe for it is it kind of sounds in a bit familiar now that i think about it so as i put these cards away i am curious um what did you guys have any disney games that you guys own because I think Mar, right, I know Mar said she hasn't um, played or heard of this game, I believe. I hope I remembered correctly. Because I have this one and I have the, di the di ugh, I can't even talk, the color, no, not color. What is it called here? Instead of me trying to guess because it's right over here. I have the Disney edition meme the game and then i have the one we're currently playing disney edition color brain and i just dropped the notepad oh you have the game scene though those are fun because just one on his xbox and dvd and then a game scene hi joseph i'm doing good how are you we're just now wrapping up playing Disney edition color brain and then we're gonna start to get ready to say goodbye earlier um, I did share I had bought a cork board and I shared the pins that I finally was able to put on there along with I shared a few items that I got at the Dollar Tree store let's see Superstore and NBC on th oh, it's on Thursday nights Oh, she's on there? I might have to check that out. And then the Amtrak Traveler was asking um, if anyone has seen Superstore. No, yeah, that's her name. I just don't want to think. I don't know if I'm going to pronounce her name right, but no, that's... And I actually didn't watch that show, but yeah, that was her, though, on Ugly Betty. I'm familiar with it, but I never watched... Oh, and then real quick, um, it says here on the bottom, though, for YouTube that you can search up, you know, how to play Disney Color Brain. Because I know I do play it, you know, just a little bit different. 
since, you know, because I want to have fun playing this game with you guys, why I play it the way that I do right here. Hey, Marianne. How are you? And oh, nice. You're cooking and listening. What are you cooking? I think I'm just hungry, too. I ask everyone, like, what are you guys making? Like, Brittany's new page, too. She's always cooking something, too. And then I'm like, oh, that sounds good. And before we also say goodbye, while well, I wait to see what Marianne... And if Marianne actually is able to answer, though, because she says she's cooking and listening, though. Um, but any last-minute questions you guys want to ask or anything before we get ready to say goodbye... Okay, you didn't watch Ugly Betty either, and you don't care for Superstore. I'm not even really sure too much what it's about, but I do. I am starting to recall the name a little bit. Um, but also for Marianne, who's cooking and listening, look at my newest shirt, Marianne. It's Mama Imelda, and on it, I know you can't really tell, but it says Mama Knows Best. And I decided to kind of color match today with Mama Imelda. Because as you can see, her eyeshadow is purple. She's got a purple top on. That's why my nails are a purple color today. Got the purple potion ears on today. And then not sure how well you guys can tell, but I have purple eyeshadow on today as well. Let's see. And then Mar says it's about a multi-purpose store like Walmart. Oh, okay. Hold on. And then of which Marianne, Marianne put, I'm jealous. She might be referring, I think you're referring to the shirt. I will say though, you know, technically my aunt, I think that's what you're talking about, Marianne. And it's, I believe, a size medium. I don't wear size medium shirts. I'm usually a large or extra large. But for some reason, you know, it looks kind of like bigger because I guess the type of style it is. But my aunt had bought it for her, for herself. But it fit her too big, so she gave it to me. Do you know that today? Oh, no, I did not know that. Today is National Chocolate Cake Day. I wish I had some chocolate cake to eat. <laughs> Ooh, but you know what? Well, actually, I have to go look. I don't think it is chocolate frosting, though. I think I have a um, white-yellow cake mix, though. Now, here and now, I might go maybe bake a cake after. Maybe I should even, but don't. It's not yet for sure. Like, maybe... Baking next with Rosa on Instagram Live next. Just kidding. I don't know. <laughs> it would be fun, though, maybe to chit chat with those of you that follow me there. The only sad thing is, you know, I know not everyone may have Instagram, but part of Rosa's world does have an Instagram. And that's where I usually will post that I'm going to go live today because I don't have the community tab option, so that's where I will post it. And National Bubble Wrap Day, what? You know, I'm curious, Mar, because sometimes like, where do you find a, about these, or where do you find out about that it's like National Such and Such Day? I am curious about that, because that would be fun, like if um, I did see your post about it, actually no, I should have thought about that. I did see it earlier, like, but that would be fun if I'm able to, not, of course, for everything. Like, if I would have baked, you know, chocolate cake today or even would have had some bubble wrap. But I'm curious, too, where do you find out about those national days? I'm curious. Is there, like, maybe a certain website or something to go to? Oh, and then real quick, because then I got sidetracked because that was, but also I meant to uh, mention about the Amtrak traveler said, I came, I saw, and I conquer. <laughs> and also, real quick, don't forget, if you have not checked out Pepper Tree Villa, please go and do so. Let me double check that before I send you guys. I know they had gone live because they usually go live at 7 p.m. because they are still live if you want to go check them out. Pepper Tree Villa. Let me see. Let's see. I gotta make sure the volume's down. Share. I'm like, how do I get back to my stream? As I, as we then have them say goodbye, I am gonna post 
their links so you can go and check them out. And then, okay, wait, so Mar says, oh, she saw the chocolate cake night one in her time hop. I googled to find out the other one. I was looking for a calendar, but it seems you have to, oh, okay, you have to check daily. Well, thank you, though, Mar. I'm like, why is that my phone? Sorry, guys, I'm trying to post the link to send you guys over there. So if you click on that, that will take you to the Pepper Tree Villas live stream. So if you guys haven't checked them out, please go and do so. Or if you have already checked them out, though, there is the link, though, for you to take you directly over there to their stream. And I will leave it up to you guys if you want to let them know or not, you know, that I sent you over there. That is totally up to you guys. But if we have then... Okay, then I might maybe look around then, but I am curious then about those. But okay, you check daily for those more. Oh, wait, you guys. Hold on, as we say goodbye. Hold on. Hold on, sorry, you guys. Give me one moment. Say sorry guys oh my goodness full of lots of i had to take that give that call to my boys but i got left without my phone so let's see you can order a calendar for 15 online i didn't invest okay yeah i wouldn't either mar 15 dollars for the calendar and then yeah thank you priscilla i'm saying how funny and i had received a call on my phone too that i had to go take to my boys so that's why now I gotta keep up with the chat over here because I no longer have my phone at the moment. And that's actually why I stepped away. Um, but yeah, no, we're just getting ready now to say goodbye. And the link that I posted up there is to go check out Pepper Tree Villa if you haven't already. They are live right now. Also, Steve's World goes live an hour before me if you haven't checked them out either. You know, please go and do so. So thank you everyone for being here. It has been fun. You know, as always. So let's see. So bye to, I think he's still here. Bye human person. Bye Mar. Bye the Amtrak Traveler. Bye Priscilla. Bye Noah, if I think you're still in here. And as always, you know, thank you to my mods for your help. And don't forget to check in next time. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> that was my oldest saying, saying that don't forget to check in next time. <laughs> um, hope you guys have a good night rest of your week and also thank you to everyone that be watching the replay and also because oh my goodness i'm like all over the place but unless they post otherwise also midlife vibes goes live um tomorrow on tuesdays at seven but yeah so bye everyone and though one last thing i do want to say what i've noticed lately when i go to end this Sometimes it doesn't end, so you guys may be seeing me again come back in because what I haven't quite figured out if there's any other ways to end this. So usually what I do, I exit out, and then I'm like, wait, it's still live. I come back in, and then I have to um, go back live for a quick second and then end it. So hopefully it doesn't do this again, but in case you see me back shortly, that is why. So bye, everyone. Have a good night. Good rest of your week.